about to leave Already packing, come with me I'm not really asking, we'll get away to a place where we What is up everybody? I just finished watching the Chris Rock comedy special Tambourine on Netflix. Very, very good. Really, really funny. Highly recommend it. Check it out. He still got it. I was a little nervous that, you know, maybe he didn't have it anymore, but really good. I got a package in from a company in that I believe is uh, something that I knew was coming. I'm not 100% sure, but let's go open that up right now. PR firm said they wanted to send me a, a box to celebrate the Chinese New Year, so I said, of course. So this is what this is. Let's try not to make too big of a mess. Dear Larry, Happy Chinese New Year. We hope you enjoyed the Abacus gift box. Please feel free to share the unboxing with your followers by tagging us at Abacus News on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram, writing hashtag Abacus News. Thank you, the Abacus team. So thank you, Abacus team. Let's take a look at what we got. I really have no idea what to expect. So, this says a little bit about Abacus. Um, just got a bunch of stuff. How to use an Abacus. Is there literally an Abacus in here? That would be awesome. Okay, it just says what everything's in here. So let's just take a look. Uh, Oh, it's a wireless charger. So this is always super handy, especially now with the iPhone 10. Super soft. It's got like that soft, non-slip stuff on it, so that's cool. Oh wow, like a notebook. Like really soft, almost looks like it's handmade. Very cool. Let's see what we got. Like a, what in the heck? That's sweet. <laughs> it's like a Rubik's Cube flashlight. That's sweet. Miles will get a kick out of that. That's awesome. That's what that's what that was in. Very cool box. Oh, got some. Let's see what we got here. And a little coin. I'll read a little bit more about it after. I didn't want to read everything it was beforehand. Got some candy and something little dog thing and bowl. So I'm not 100% sure what these are, but again, we'll take a look after. And then this, what do we got here? Not sure. Maybe it's just like envelopes. Not sure what these are for. We'll take a look. And then here is the abacus. So 
let Miles use this for his homework. Oh. There's some more of these coins, but little ones. Very cool. Some history about the Chinese tech industry. Here is the abacus and how to use it. More how to use it. <laughs> uh, inside the mini box, Chinese candy. Red envelopes. Chinese people regard red as a symbol of energy, happiness, and good luck. People give family members and friends red envelopes with money in them as a way to send good wishes and luck, as well as money. Uh, we've also included some extra envelopes for you to send to loved ones. A lucky coin, which is what this is. An ornament of lucky coins and red tassels is believed to attract fortune, financial vibes, as well as providing protection and good luck in general. The coins are molded after ancient Chinese money, which was molded with a hole in the middle so you could always be so it could be threaded for easy handling. Ingot. Chinese gold ingots used in the shape oh that's what this is. Shape like a boat. For this reason it symbolizes the transportation of riches from one point or person to another. Gold ingots were first used by Chinese emperors as currency. The dog. Those born in the year of the dog are thought to have thought to be loyal, honest, responsible, clever, courageous, and playful. There are twelve animals in the signs of the Chinese zodiac. Your birth sign comes around once every twelve years. To figure out which year, if you're a year of the dog, you can subtract intervals of twelve from 2018, or just look at the chart below. I think I am um, the dragon, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, dragon, 1976. Very cool, man. Big thanks to uh, Abacus for sending us out. I mean, this is, this may be one of the coolest things I've ever unboxed on the channel. So, big thanks to them. And uh, let's continue with the vlog. Oh, about to see the world in action. What we can be. Life with no distractions. We'll get away. That's going to be it for this one. Hope you guys enjoyed it. I will check you guys out tomorrow. If you did like the video, hit the thumbs up. If you have to subscribe, do that down below. And uh, I will talk to you guys tomorrow.